Welcome to our lecture online. In this particular infinite series, we have what we call the P series. We have a couple of examples. The P series, the general equation of that would be the infinite sum from n equals 1 to infinity of 1 over n to the P power. Now in this example, P is equal to 3. So we have 1 over n to the third power. In this example, we have 1 over the square root of n. So in this case, P is equal to 1 half. The test tells us that if p is greater than 1, we know that the series will converge. So that satisfies that condition, and therefore the first example does converge. But the second example, here we can see that p is less than 1, and therefore we can conclude that the series diverges. It seems kind of odd in a way when you use your intuition. Sometimes your intuition will get you into trouble, but even though the denominator continues to grow, because the square root of a growing number will still grow, but it doesn't grow fast enough, and therefore the series does not converge. The way to know for sure is to check to see the value for p. If it's greater than 1, it converges. If it's less than 1, it diverges. And so here you have two nice examples to exemplify that. That's how it's done.